On September 22, 2020, 31-year-old Maria Munoz was found dead in her home in Laredo, Texas. It was initially thought to be an overdose, but it was later discovered that she had been murdered by her estranged husband, 42-year-old Joel Peo. In the late 2000s, Maria, a nursing student, met Joel, an established nurse anesthetist in Puerto Rico. Their shared passion for nursing sparked a connection between them, leading to a romance and eventual marriage. They moved to Texas, where they started a family, having two boys. Maria decided to become a stay-at-home mother and gave up her career to raise her children. After years of being happy together, the couple's marriage began to fall apart. Joel started having an affair with a woman named Janet Arredondo, leading to his and Maria's separation. They maintained contact for the sake of their children, but Joel had already moved in with Janet. On the night of September 22, 2020, Joel went to Maria's home in Laredo for a heart-to-heart -heart discussion about their strained marriage. However, the situation escalated and Maria ended up dead. Joel's 911 call suggested a possible overdose, but his nervous behavior during police questioning cast doubt on this narrative. There's 911 with the address of emergency. Hello, I'll call my wife on her She's not breathing. Okay. She may have taken some, some pills. Okay, what is your address? The discovery of a syringe wrapper and IV equipment in the home further complicated the situation. Investigations into Maria's death revealed inconsistencies. Despite Joel's claim of an overdose, there was no pill residue found in Maria's system. Instead, the autopsy and toxicology reports indicated the presence of seven different drugs typically used in surgical settings and requiring IV administration. This evidence contradicted the overdose theory and pointed towards a more deliberate act. The lack of defensive wounds on Maria's body and her journals, which refuted any suicidal inclinations, further implicated Joel in her death. Maria's journals were crucial to the investigation. They indicated that she still had love for Joel, but had accepted his decision to be with someone else. It seemed like she was in a good place mentally and was thinking about the future for herself and her children rather than ending her own life. The investigation further showed that Joel's profession gave him access to the drugs found in Maria's system. Dr. John Hunsinger, Joel's former boss, noted the unusual presence of propofol, a drug not typically used outside of a hospital. This fact, along with the other drugs found, suggested foul play. The prosecution put together a very strong case and in March 2023, Joel Peyo was found guilty of murdering Maria Munoz and tampering with evidence. He was sentenced to life in prison for the murder and an additional 10 years plus a $10,000 fine for tampering with evidence. 